Hello there, beautiful people. Welcome back again to Unhacked Channel. For people that don't know, my name is Anes. I'm working for you. So if you have any questions in the video request, make sure to drop them below in a comment. I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back. And please be a witness for that because I made over 250 videos so far on Shopify customization. They were mostly requested by you guys. And I know some people not even subscribers, but I'm fine with that. I still make the video for them. So don't hesitate, man. If you have any video requests or any questions, so drop me a comment below. I would be happy to provide you with information you need or even make a video for you. And yeah, you don't have to subscribe. Maybe now you should consider doing so because if you don't, you lose. Now it's a very different chapter on this channel. I usually share small customizations, but now we'll be sharing complete sections and widgets, highly customizable to make a Shopify store very unique and very professional without having to pay for those expensive teams or hiring those expensive developers or even worse, paying for those monthly subscription applications that will drain your money and it's not a very good idea for long-term projects. But I give you a better deal. Scroll down to the channel, check out the videos and sections I'm sharing, and I'll let you be the judge and I'll respect your decision. But for now, let me show you how to add one of, actually, he did request me this video like two weeks ago. I apologize for the person who did that. I was really busy with some other stuff, but anyway. In this video, I will show you how to add the animated bullet points text on the product page on your Shopify store, and it's highly customizable. You can customize the color for the animated like points because it has an animated point. You will see that in a second. Also the text, colors and text, of course, and so on. And yeah, it's completely free by using your own custom code and no applications involved. And without any more talking, let's just jump to it. As you can see, this is Shopify down team. So I always start with completely new team, nothing on it. And each video I add small customizations, but video like 60 or 70, the team will be completely different. But now I think I reached that level halfway already. For example, check out this all-in-one reviews carousel that will show you reviews from multiple sources, Google, Facebook, Amazon, and Etsy, all in one place, and it's filterable. If I click on Google, only the reviews from Google, and so on for the others as well. Or even better, check out this recent sales notification that will show you the recent sales on your Shopify store by using your own custom code again, and it's highly customizable. You can customize the position for it and the intervals and for who to show up to, for first-time visitors or returning visitors, and many, many options that you don't even need. And yes, by using your own custom code. What else you need, man? I apologize, I will quit now. So I will scroll down to access a product to show you what I'm talking about. So I will scroll, start scrolling right now, and every little thing that you see in this Shopify store, every section has been done in videos. So if you saw anything that you liked and you think it looks good, and you want to implement it in your store as well, then just check out the channel. Because once it's here, it means it's already done in one of my previous videos. I don't remove the changes from here, I keep them so people can see them. Again, if you saw anything you like, check out the channel, it's already done. And uh, let me access this product, for example. Or did I, do, do we actually need any? <laughs> Look how many widgets in here. And all of these without using a single application and all of them are free, even the wishlist system. Wishlist system on your Shopify store by using the uh, icon as well on the header. Yes, I did that in videos and completely free. But in this video, we will add another one again which I will add it, you can add it anywhere you want on the product page. But for me, I will add it below the buy it now button, which is the perfect location for it. And yeah, this one as well, many, many more. I, do. I cannot mention them all. <laughs> so we will keep this page open or actually we don't. So get back to Shopify dashboard. The first thing you're going to do is click on all I store, then click on teams, then click on customize. And you might be thinking, oh, it's already available on the team editor. No, it's not. We will add it by using our own custom code. So click on the home page like this, then click on product and click on default template we are using for the product page. In my case, I'm using the default one. And uh, let me switch to the another product, which is this one or this one, the anchor bracelet. So we will add it, as I said, below the byte now. So on the left panel, as you can see, it says here like a buy, it, buy button, sorry. Below it, hover over it, and you will see add block. Click on it and a bunch of options will show up and you click on custom liquid. And yes, because this is a custom liquid, so it will work on every Shopify team, no matter if it's paid or free. So in here, we need to pass in the code for the animated bullet points text. And to do that, scroll that description box and you will see a link, my website completely free again, click on it and it will take you to this page right here. As I said, completely free. Just scroll down a little bit and you will see it here. So this is the code and this is the text. So text, this is actually, 
a copy uh, the, uh, the emojis, the copied emojis, you can remove them because this is a text. You can edit this text, anything you like. Uh, the first one says homemade with love. The second one free, uh, free worldwide shipping, uh, free returns with refund and 30 days uh, guaranteed money back and blah, blah, blah. You can uh, adjust this text to anything you want and the emojis to change them or completely remove them. And it has a color. Let me show you actually that so I can show you how to change the color. Simply click on this. I don't know if you saw that. Click on this icon to copy the code. Then get back in here and simply paste it in here and it should show up. And here it is. I don't know if you can see, but these ones are blinking. As you can see, the circles are blinking. And this is the text on each one. And to change the color of the blinking dots, simply scroll down a little bit and here is the background color. This is the color for it. If I Google this one, it will show me the color picker. Here it is, as you can see, light purple. You can change the color to any color you want. And that's how you add the animated uh, blanking bullet points text on your Shopify product page by using your own custom code. And if you have any questions or any customizations, make sure to drop on below. But for now, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.